Hey, what is up you guys? My name is Mike Spiller. Welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to show you guys how to download and install Mixture of 9 and also give you guys a short tutorial, you know, on, on all the basics and fundamentals, you know, on how to get you started. It's an amazing um, software. It's free to use. Definitely my one of my top recommendations. If you don't have money for all these um, top expensive um, softwares like Cubase, Logic, etc. So yeah, Mixtroft 9, dude. Um, I made a separate video on Mixtroft 8 as well. This one is going to be a little bit different because I don't think you can download older versions anymore. Um, it's a shame because there's some things that Mixtroft 9 has that I wish that, that 8 had that they took out for 9 that I wish that I would that they would have left. But um, anyway, let's get into it. My name is Mike Spiller. I'm a self-taught songwriter, studio sound engineer, and performing artist, and I teach other upcoming artists everything I learned on my journey to help you grow faster. Join the change movement where we encourage you to be nothing but you. The real, unique, and authentic you. Alright, so... You're just gonna go into Google and obviously type in acoustica.com if you didn't know. Um, they are the creators of Mixcraft, uh, amazing company, and I highly recommend any one of their products. There, yeah, it's it's very affordable and it's it's, it's dope, dude. Um, all right, and there you go. I'll put the link in the description below, so you can just click on that link. It's gonna take you right to here. Now, they do give a free trial of 30 days that you can use and then you can ex experiment with it after that you will have to license it like literally buy a, a license for the software starting at 75 dollars as you can see but yeah there you go um i'll put the link to the free demo as well in there but yeah i highly dude it's not that much i mean if you really think about it this is for your future so 75 dollars is not a big ass amount of money to spend on something that is literally gonna be one of the like foundations of your career you know having a software like this um, saves you a lot of time and energy and money as well you don't need to go to a professional ass studio like nowadays it's so much better to just get these things yourself and just put the work in do it study and yeah trust me but yeah once you have that let me open up my Mixcraft 9. I have the recording studio version. Just be patient with my laptop. Alright. For those who don't know, I do sell VST plugins as well. So um, I'll put a link in the description as well if you want to check that out. Okay, so here we are. After you um, installed and all of that, this is gonna be. Make, I'm so I'm I'm sure I don't need to explain how to install a program. Like this is like if you know how to do a, a simple YouTube search, I'm sure you can figure it out. Now, once we are in, let me just show you what we have here. All right, obviously, this is where you're gonna be saving. Preferences will be the first thing that you go to, obviously, and then you'll select your your driver. Uh, your default recording device and then your, your output playback device obviously once you have that set up I guess we can start so here are your your track channels as you can see um, quite simple this is where you set the snap time or beats um, yeah, quite simple you can just play around with this but I wanted to get started in like let's say you have your program open now, okay? Then we're gonna get a beat. Okay, let's go to downloads. I have a beat here. All right, let's say this is the instrumental that you want to use, right? You're just gonna drag it in to one of the tracks, right? Let it finish loading. It's so straightforward. That's why I love Mixcraft. It's so user friendly, dude. Like anyone can work with Mixcraft, even if you have zero experience at all. Alright, then make sure it's all the way to the left. And then yeah, you're gonna gonna play it. And then yeah, blah blah blah. As you can see. There's no playback now. And then over here you're gonna that's how you can mute or solo a track, as you can see. Uh monitor. 
effects this is where you'll be adding your effects like I said with your plugins and all of that again check the description below if you want to buy some plugins including fire ass autotune that I'm willing to sell and then yeah here's the master track at the bottom here next to this line you're gonna click here that's where you'll find like your big tabs you can go to project or you can go to mixer where you can do some essential mixing and mastering over here basically over here you can just set levels but it's it's it's, it's a nice shortcut to access everything and then here's your library for those producers and stuff like that for those who want to make beats right click and then you can just say add audio or if you want to make a beat like let's say add instrument track right then you're going to click over here and then simply choose the instrument whatever you want to use and then go for it all right if you guys have any questions let me know down below yeah dude like i said it's very very simple and it's straightforward bro um i think that's it so yeah, like I said, go 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 get yourself Mixcraft, dude. It's it's probably the cheapest software out there for this quality. I promise you, and it easily competes with like the highest of all of them, dude. And again, it's free, so you have nothing to lose. So I I, I honestly think it's like it's 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 probably one of the best, bro. Honestly, but yeah. With that said, um, let me know down below if you guys have any questions, and I'll get back to you on that. Until the next one, peace.